Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Tyranoid here, and I am going to be giving you a quick update on the channel with some COD4 in the background. So I just wanted to let you know where what what where this channel's going really. I mean, obviously over the past year I've sort of strayed away from Let's Plays and sort of gone to uploading clips of things I feel, find cool, um, online gameplays, um, reviews. Reviews is a one I'm particularly interested in doing. So I just want to let you know really what the plans are, at least for the next couple of months. Um, basically, I'm going to carry on with like, because I think I'm done with Infinite Warfare now, because I don't want to, I want to branch out and play as many games as possible, so... I've hit where I want to hit on the multiplayer on that. I'm done with that kind of... I may end up going back for a few games in the future, but at the moment, uh, multiplayer-wise, you're going to see COD 4, because I still want to play a bit more of that. So the remastered COD 4 multiplayer will be coming on. Um, GTA 5, that's just a continuing thing. Occasionally, we just all jump on and have a laugh, and um, you'll get clips of that. Um... In terms of actual playthroughs and stuff, I have quite a few actually. I've got San Andreas that I plan to start soon. Um, obviously I've finished the actual playthrough, but I've gone back to Vice City and I'm just trying to platinum it. And I've got a few more trophies. I think I've just got to do the stunt jumps and max out my criminal rating, which apparently is meant to be an absolute bitch in Vice City. So I have no idea how that's going to go. But when I am done with that, or when I see fit to give up, I will start San Andreas. And it'll be exactly like the Vice City playthrough. I'm going to trim it all down so you've just got the missions and everything. And, you know, it, it's it's almost like a story for you lot to follow, but it's also a guide if you need one. Um, <laughs> I'm sure I'm, I was at least half decent at the Vice City missions, and I might have been some help for you. So they, there's that. Um, other campaigns, I've obviously got um, Assassin's Creed Brotherhood and Revelations that I'm currently going to be playing through. I'm about to start Brotherhood actually in the next couple of days, so you'll start seeing more clips of that. Um, I've also got the uh, Vice City, uh, not Vice City, I'm going back to Vice City now. I've also got the um, Modern Warfare Remastered campaign on Veteran. Now there's a f bit of a story behind this. I had a few more levels that I did. But my recording fucked up. So I finished the levels. I think I got past the nuke going off. And I did the whole nuke going off. And then the, the, the little aftermath scene. But it didn't record it. So even though I've beaten it on veteran. And I managed to do it without dying as well. Which is a real shame. Because I'm that level used to really piss me off. So now I've got to go back through it. And hopefully be as skillful as the first time. Which I won't be now. It's going to be recorded. But I do carry on. I do, I do plan on carrying on with that, so expect some of that. Um, I will end up going back to the Uncharted 4 campaign on Crushing. It is, it is my plan to do that at some point. I've just not got around to it. I, I got stuck, actually, on a particular level. So I, I must have spent about three hours on this one part and just thought, fuck it, I'll go do something else. Um, I don't think you lot want to watch three hours of fails. Uh, so yeah, I think that's really my main plan. Obviously, you've got Vice City to be finished. You've got uh, Grand Theft Auto San Andreas, uh, COD 4 Remastered Campaign on Veteran, Uncharted 4 Crushing, and uh, the Assassin's Creed Ezio Collection. I will... I, I am I'm debating this. I really am. Um, but I don't know if you guys know, but I'm a massive, massive Mass Effect fan. So when Andromeda comes out, I'm kind of thinking of doing a Let's Play. It will severely limit the amount of time I get to play on Andromeda. But I think it'll be good as well because it will really give me the chance to just not rush it and really take my time with it. So I am thinking of doing a Let's Play of Andromeda. I think that will actually be pretty cool, especially with all the choices that you can make. So you can expect that probably sometime soon. Um, now, on to the last thing. I do plan on carrying on with reviews. Uh, I've got a load of games to review still. Um, I think it's... Oh, God, it must be about 20 other games to review. 
Um, and obviously when I get new games and I beat them, I'm going to review them as well. So there's a lot of reviews coming and I think it, it's, I've never really like, obviously, because I've not had the software to do, do it, but with the PS4, it might not be the best software ever, but I've been able to actually edit videos down and mess around a bit more and record longer videos and add some cool stuff in if I want to. So it's been really nice doing these reviews and being able to like do 20, 30 minute videos with my thoughts on the game and being able to edit it down. So I will be carrying on with that. I think the next review actually is going to be, I'm just looking at my list of games now, I think it's going to be Battlefield 4. So I will probably do a review of Battlefield 4. Um, but don't expect those reviews to come out often. I want to kind of pace them out as well. Kind of rush the first few few reviews out. It was all Call of Duty, wasn't it? So I wanted to get it out of the way. Um, so yeah, I think Battlefield 4 will be the next one. I'll probably expect that in the next... Well, probably February. Probably towards the end of February, though. So yeah, that's that. So they're, they're basically my plans for YouTube, guys. Um, just going to be clips and reviews, really, and... I might occasionally like use my COD4 gameplays to make like commentaries if I want to. It depends whether I've got anything useful to say. So, um, yeah, they're my plans for the future, guys. Um, if they do interest you, then feel free to stick around. It's It'll be nice to have uh, a few cool, dedicated followers following. Um, but, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. If you... Uh, want to click that subscribe button or if you want to click that lovely thumbs up button or whatnot just uh so i can appear on youtube a bit more but yeah guys thanks for watching and i will see you next time because i'm going to wrestle my pug now he seems to be wanting to play tug of war so yeah <laughs> I'll, I'll go for good this time guys thank you very much and i'll see you next time yeah i know but i was wanting to have a chat and then I met the bloody juggernaut guy. Oh my god, piss off with your sniper. You are literally ace. There's literally nothing good about these guys. I'm sitting back sniping, and there's guys sitting back with juggernaut and marshmallow. I've just been shot through the tank. Wasn't that tank meant to be like super thick? Thick as fuck. Yeah, I've just been shot through it. Well, I don't think any of this matters because we are kicking our ass. Yeah, that's because I'm on 21 captures. No tags. You're at second place with 9 tags. Our team's not doing that great. Oh, they fucking got an enemy helicopter. I forgot about that. I'm just, it's literally just me getting a kill, collecting a tag or so, and then dying like twice, and then collecting a tag. And now I'm getting targeted by the helicopter on top of the team. Oh, never. Does it target you depending on where you are on the team, then? Well, that I does think explain so, why. Because yeah, because I seem to get fucking battered by the helicopter all the time. Get, I always get targeted by the helicopter. I'm always the first person to get hit, and I get killed like three times in a row. So I was shooting at this. I've just been spawn killed. I keep spawning in the same position. I've got the spawn fucking not killed. <laughs> this guy tried to come behind me and knife me friendly, but I was ready for him. So I got up and just like, I have never pressed the trigger on um, the pistol so hard before. Time is running out. That's pretty weird.
wasn't for him. I don't think he was at Hey guys, if you made it to the end of the video, I just thought I'd leave the rest of this uh, gameplay for you to watch. Uh, I must say, I do apologise about my brother. Uh, Call of Duty seems to be making him very angry at the moment, so uh, you're probably going to see a lot of rage in a lot of the Call of Duty videos where I'm playing with him. But yeah, uh, I just thought I'd let you know, guys. Um, but that's just him. Alright, this is me going for good this time. Thank you very much. I'll see you next time.